Welcome back, Jack Chan Gaming. Today we're playing some Conflict of the Storm 2. Holy crap. Long time no see. I'm just a busy guy. I don't know what to tell you. I don't know what to tell you. School coming up, you know. Um, College wise. Work all the time. I have every day. It gets, you know, it gets pretty ridiculous to be able to keep up with YouTube. So bear with me, everyone. Um, this is called Air Cover. And we are uh, second to last level, actually. We're going to approaching the complex of the super guns we need to destroy in the last level. And these are the super guns here that we must destroy. They look pretty BA. They do some pretty bad damage. Scientists are running away. Animation's not too bad. That gun's brutal, and it's making some huge explosions in the distance. It doesn't look good to me. That's why we're going there to destroy it, though. Am I right? Look at these horses. <sighs> yeah. Roger that, variable one. Orders understood. Out. All points on me. We have our orders. Move. Maybe if he was actually a guy, though. Look, it's Bradley saying that he wants his Bradley back in one piece. Does that mean that that's Bradley's Bradley? Thanks, called it Brad. I don't know. Anyway, <clears throat> this is kind of the airport area. I'm not sure if this is Iraq or Kuwait. It's probably one or the other. But starting off strong with a headshot, and there actually is a tank in the distance. But we killed the commander out of that because Foley is a complete and utter BA. So, like I said, second to last level on this game. There's 50, 10 levels instead of 15 like the first one. And this one leads into going into the main place. Interesting enough. Maps are still pretty cool. I'm not sure why this guy hasn't died yet. Screw you. Piece of crap. So smoke grenades help to get between places without a gay tank seeing you. So Jones will do his BA business and bring this tiger down. All in the while being shot by literally everyone in the area because he's just a complete brute. Well, compared to Connors, no, he's not a brute, but he's a demolition brute. Then again, so is Connors. So, who is the bigger brute? Physically, we'll go with Connors. Anyway, we got a secret room up here we like to hide in, and I'm not sure what this guy's deal is hiding behind this wooden. Oh, he's good. He's good. Or at least he was good until he got shot and died. And anyone who has tried has died. Morpheus. Ugh. Trying to hide behind a dumpster. What's that guy's deal? I mean, kudos for trying to hide, but you can't escape the U.S. Delta Force. Neither can his tank. Wow, that thing sucked. Literally let me walk straight up to it and do my business. And if there are guys in here, they're getting destroyed by shotgun. Shotgun's so classy. Anyway, main entrance here, or at least it doesn't look like a main entrance, but I guess it kind of is. I don't know, it's kind of a crappy main entrance, this little door. Then again, this is Iraq slash Afghanistan slash Kuwait. That is Afghanistan. No, that's Iraq. I don't care about Middle Eastern geography. I don't know why. What the heck is going on in here? Oh, I just got raped. We're gonna drop this guy. You think you can attack and kill my man? You think you're cool? He's not. So, Connors is good. He'll pull through. Anyway. That guy's leg was up weird. Anyway, this is the dark cafeteria. The lights are out, so we turn on night vision. We'll light people up. We're trying to hide in the uh, kitchen. Not gonna work. They think they can hide in the light, but I am in the dark. I am a beast. Throw a phosphorus in there. I think I missed. I don't even know. Throw another one in there just for fun. Anyone around? Oh, someone's gonna get this, and they're gonna like it. Yep. I don't know the whole crew is in there. Jeez. 
Can I not just, you know, do my stuff or what? Maybe that kid's shooting me. Holy crap! Some people's kids. Anyway, I think the hangar's over there. Little Rimsher's med kit's hanging around. Her rocket launcher in the corner. You gotta look for them. Especially on a harder difficulty. So this is the hangar. There's another hangar level, much like on this, much like this on the uh, Matrix game that I showed you a while ago. Oh, he's good. Oh, he's good. Was good. Not anymore. Double tapped him. Because I don't appreciate a-holes like him. What's that guy doing? That, I, I wonder if I got him. I even zoomed in the whole way and we're taking him down because we're that legendary. Oh. Leg shot. Oh. Oh, that was almost a two for one. Wow. Wasn't even zoomed in the whole way. Talk about legendary. I will tell you what. Ooh. So I went up the stairs of death. I'm not sure why everything's so dark on this map. You know, the cafeteria, the stairway. You know, it's a corner and all. And who killed that guy? Did he kill his friend? Did he just murder his friend and throw a grenade on his dead body? I don't know how I feel about that. But we are cleaning house right now. A little office area. There's a printer and everything. Blow up these SAM sites in the distance. With these Kuwaitian tour buses down there that I'm seeing. But you know, it's whatever. So are these guys and their dead bodies on these stairs. Because they think they could stop me. Instead, they'll pay the ultimate price, along with these guys. Wow. Wow. Once again, dark room strike again. They strike again. That was a luggage room. This is high tech. I think it's 2000s, early 2000s, I think this game is supposed to take place. If not 90s. I think it might be 90s, and again, this stuff looks kind of good. I don't know, I'll have to look into it. The RPG guy. And I got killed before he got one off on me, because he always likes to try. He always likes to try, but I know where he's at now, and he fails utterly every time. And the whole crew's here. I guess the whole crew didn't make it after all. Which is good, sure. But this is where crap gets crazy. Real open couple tanks hanging out. Hey, yeah, gun in the distance. That tank standing right there. Oh! If it shoots in here, we're all screwed. Oh, jeez. That was close. What an a-hole. Thinks he can kill Connors. I don't know what makes it think that they can kill Connors. I mean, the guy's a brute. And that guy, I don't know what his deal was. He was just running straight for death. Are you kidding me? An invisible wall? God, this game's rigged. Oh, this game's so rigged. Jeez, come on. Invisible wall? Mm. You can clearly see through it, but since it's a PS2 game, that's an invisible wall and you get screwed over for it. You know what I mean? It just does not work. I'd rather not be killed while approaching this thing. So I'm going to smoke grenade it up like a champ. Absolute champ. And light all these hombres up. Well, uh, Spanish wouldn't be the right term. Since they're Middle Eastern, they wouldn't be hombres. They wouldn't be essays. Hmm. I don't know what you'd call them. Without trying to be racist in any way. I only think of one that's pretty racist. So let's get a bomb on his AA gun anyway. Um, ah, guess that's where we're supposed to go. It looks like a big garage door. 
taking fire. I'll lay down, take the fire real good. Sneak in through here. Those guys just got mauled. And I'll maul them again with an explosion. That's pretty funny. Um. I guess I'll go in this wall here. Not wall. Well, you can't go through walls. You go through doors. Jeez. We left Bradley behind because he's laying there to a, um, uh... What is he doing again? Um... He's leading the back up so no one stinks up behind us to kill us. Uh, so he's watching her back because he likes to come from behind and, you know, try to kill us. And I don't want him on the front lines because he'll, he sucks and he'll die. So, I feel the need to leave him back there while troops, like, real troops, like Foley, charge up dark staircases, point-blanking Iraqis with automatic weapons. Because he's going to storm this whole place right here. And I'm going to leave it completely uncut. Because it is just so epic. It's like, hey, you got a little lobby sitting room here? Sure. A little bar in the corner? Let's just walk by it. You know, we'll kill this guy point blank, kill this guy point blank, kill that guy moderately point blank, and we'll have been limp behind this desk because I actually took a few lead bullets there. Um. Oh, another man coming. Well, you shall pay the price. And so will your friend! Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. And you know, that's what I'm talking about. Dead end. They boarded it shut. Why they board that door shut, not this one? Secret closet. Medkit. Medkit. No, just like toolboxes. Whatever. Oh, that was visible walled. Boy, oh, just sucked and threw it straight down like an idiot. I don't even know what to tell you. What he just did. Those two guys just got point blank to death. They sucked so bad. No one's up here. Maybe someone's around the corner. Last dead end, dead end, dead end. Anyone in here? No, no one's in here. Iraqi equipment. Let's shoot the crap out of it. They're not allowed to keep any of it because I do not like them. They can use this against us and we do not want that. Perfect. We get Jonesy boy in here. Bradley's killing one guy every five minutes because he sucks. Uh, Jonesy boy will be setting a C4 for me in this room to blow up some kind of equipment. Not sure what for, but he's a champ and he's going to do it for me. No questions asked. And this door opens up and it's the people from the beginning. Let's talk Bradley's Bradley. Tanks called it Bradley. Why are they in here and why aren't they? Oh man, those Iraqis killing them. Oh, I'm gonna really kill this guy now. You tell me those Iraqis killed my marine friends. They killed them all. There's an empty tank sitting there. And these are my marine buddies laying here dead. Oh, he's been with me since, like, level one. Well, this sucks. Um, hmm. I'm gonna have to wait for Bradley. Which is retarded, because no one likes him. Take care of my own squad, but he can go eat crap somewhere. Oh, well, um, yeah, Conflict of the Storm 2, second to last level, air cover. Next one is the last episode in the series. Not series, I'll do best moments like I did last time, but of the game. Um, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, like it if you liked it, comment if you have something to say, or if you missed my pr presence. Um, subscribe if you haven't already. This is Jack Gen Gaming. Till next time.